Hey guys, welcome to Bambi TV. Guys, we'll be reacting to OnlyFans Gamer Girl Get Exposed by Man. Guys, let's get straight into this. Exposed! So, first thing you do is you bend your knees and you stop asking girls to jump up and down on TikTok, you sick fuck. Hold up. Wait a minute. Something ain't right. Exposed! Yeah, the sick f**ks you're talking to are also the simps that pay for your shitty OnlyFans and after looking at your Instagram profile and how few likes you get, you might want to talk to them a little nicer. Because I doubt this donut is making more than $500 a month like most OnlyFans girls, so without those simps, she's completely broke. Alright, if you're a boy and you ever plan on being intimate with a girl- No thanks. Anyways guys, I think I found my new favourite Excel keyboard shortcut. If you hit Alt W V G, it gets rid of all the grid lines. Thank me later. Fellas, if you ever find something like this, then smash that shit up, get the hell out of there, and don't look back. Please. That man, and that man's obsessed with me forever till this day. I, I say beat him. Babe, I beat up my ex and that man still hits Exa me Exactly. Up. The ones that you beat up, they want. <laughs> I told you, they're dogs. They, train they them. They are. They're not right. Train them. What Put the them fuck? on a fucking leash and train them. I beg your pardon? That's what I'm saying. If a group of men were having this same conversation about women, they'd be exposed and completely ruined. But when women are having it, apparently it's funny. Red flag that I've seen a guy is having a mom and even worse, having a sister. Okay, it's fair enough. But what are you into? Transformers? Pokemon? You fucking child? Damn. You want me to be an orphan? Well, unfortunately, I have both a mom and a sister. Oh, wow. Do you have any aunts? Three. Wow. Is your grandma still alive? Um, one of them's gone. Yeah, the other one's still here. Yeah. All right. I was thinking it's like this. <laughs> I'm a green flag. Of course, I don't have a guy best friend. Ooh. I'm a green flag. Of course, I'll share my location with you. What? I'm a green flag. Of course, I want to cook for you and do the dishes for you. Ooh. I'm a green flag. Of course, I've never had a one night stand. That's what I'm talking about. Looking for my dream man to pull up in a Honda for me to be proud of his nine to five. I don't want anything else. And I still can't find him. <laughs> Only fans detected, opinion rejected. Women complain way too much about wearing heels. I've seen so many videos of women falling in heels. And today, I'm going to put it to the test. Oh, pause. To see if wearing heels is actually that bad. Starting out with walking. A little bit of skipping, a little bit of skipping. Full on sprinting! There's no brakes on these things. Maybe do a little car wheel. You know I had to hit some squats. Now it's time for the heels 40 yard dash. And to be honest with you, it surprised me. Funny. Now that I've done all my tests, I'm proud to say, women, you are overreacting. Heels are not that bad. Someone said in the comments he destroyed all women in a single video. Yes. And then you got a bunch of women saying, try without socks or you're using short heels. Yeah, because all of you could do backflips or squats as long as you had socks on. I <laughs> doubt it. <laughs> Would you be with a girl who worked like a McDonald's? But she's a great person. Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah. Then why, then yes. why wouldn't they? So you would? Why wouldn't they? No, but some people think even what their partner does as a career would, would make a difference in how they would view them. Like I say, I always say this thing of women overlook the bin men, women overlook the, the postman, and then they're going to complain when they get dealt with a certain kind of way. But that postman, that bin man could be the most ambitious guy. He's just doing what he's doing for the meantime before he turns a corner oh, and he turns into the greatest man in the world. So how can I judge her that works in McDonald's? Especially if she's length. You know, certain times in McDonald's, they've got the little tight trousers and all of that on. You might see the little shape when she turns to get you the Big Mac. You understand? Yeah. And all of that. So she, and she's length. She just works in McDonald's. Let's not do that. Let's not do that. We're not going to judge people because they work in McDonald's. If a man's physically attracted to a woman and she gives him peace of mind and respect, then he's not going to give a shit if she works at McDonald's. Whereas a woman, right. she's going to care how much a man earns. Most women are hypergamous and want their man to earn more. Hey Johnny, so how do you feel about the fight coming up? Pretty good, man. Pretty good? You guys doing some shopping today? A little bit. A little bit? How, how much did you spend on you today? 75000 75? 85. Oh, 85. <laughs> 
Okay. Is 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 the fight gonna be a knockout or what? What can we expect? Absolutely. <laughs> All right, Johnny. Appreciate you, bro. Good luck, man, on the fight. I don't care how much money you got. I think you're a bit of a muppet if you spend that much money on an OnlyFans girl that'd leave you at the drop of the hat if you went broke. Seven. You're 24. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. You look good for 24. I cannot lie. Thank you. Um. Let me see. What's that supposed to mean? I'm old. Nah. Nah. I'm just saying. Like you look. You look young. You you look like you could be like 20. Let me see. What's one thing you look for in a guy? Like a relationship guy, not no, you feel me? Like if, you, if you're looking for a boyfriend, what's one thing you're looking for? Smart, knows Smart. how to manage money. Mm, okay. Do you manage money? I do. That's good. Love that for you. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you good. You can go. The most concerning thing about this is everybody saying in the comments that this kid is 16 years old. So I don't know what a growing ass woman is doing there, trying to compete for him. If it's the other way around and it's a man with a young girl. You going to jail. <laughs> you going, going to jail. jail. Everything's gonna be okay. Please don't fight. Everything's gonna be okay. Don't argue. Baby, don't argue. Uh, don't argue. It's gonna be okay. How jealous do you want your man to be? Oh my god. <laughs> I want him to be trolling. I want him to tell me not to go out, not to wear this, not to do that, not to do this. <laughs> But yeah. like, like a healthy amount. Yeah. But most women would say a man shouldn't have any say in how I dress. You shouldn't tell me not to go out with my girls. Why do you feel differently? I just think it's really attractive. I think it is too. I think it shows that like the man actually like cares about. Oh my god, this part is like, <laughs> into me. It shows that the man really cares about the way that other people like perceive their woman. But to a certain extent, of course, like not to the point where it's like you literally can't go out by yourself with your own friends. Like I think a healthy amount of jealousy is fine. Would you still want to go out to the club with your girls if you were in a healthy relationship with your man? No. 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 You're not going to have to tell a grown ass woman this type of stuff because she'll know better. She's not going to do anything to disrespect you or make you feel jealous. Yeah. I mean, I'm not gonna be worried at all. I think at most all. men like me would just think you're her two gay friends. What's your body count? <laughs> 20. 20. Let me go to my notes app. I'll just show it to the camera. <laughs> if this is a list. So, you know, we got all that. that okay, so, period. like. And I don't regret a single one. We all have fun. Okay, so, like, we on all the number, what, what, how much you think that this is? This gotta be at least 60. At least 60. <laughs> she got 60. I have more than that. Yeah. Are we counting work or not work? Because okay. I do this for work. Okay. Yeah, so if we're counting work, I don't know. There's only one place a woman like this belongs. She belongs to the streets. How? Like, how? What, what are we talking about? Mm, that I can say, like, this is, uh, mm, I was about to complain that a human being has 20. And then I saw at least 60. Then someone said he has more than that. Like, it's fucked up, to be honest. I, I see. Why are you going to be connected with more than 10 people? But like 20 is huge, bro. Then you having 60 and writing their names down, you are just... Bro, she's a psychopath. <laughs> you won't tell me anything different, like, she's a psychopath. Like, what the... How? Like, how? I love his videos. I love his videos every day. That's why I love checking it out. But like... So women are really, 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 really delusional. And there are things that women can do and they get away with it easily. I give you one hit a guy and they be like, oh, you yeah, guy. But like, they are the one that, let's say, I the one that wants equality. So I don't get the reason why we shouldn't be treated equally. More like in the next 10 years now, guys who want to be treated equally with women because signs are coming out that women are not actually treating guys equally because it's, it's fucked up. But I don't really think about the video, just to like, share, subscribe to my channel. I'll see you next time, guys. Friends.